These are two books, and they're both written by Dr. Seuss. I'm going to read I Am a, I am the Lorax first. I am the Lorax. I speak for the truth. Sit down and listen to my tale, if you please. I live in a place where the grass is all green, and the air is sweet and fresh, and the water is clean. There once was a time when a uh, one bird came here and cut down all the trees you could see far and near. He used the tree trucks to make things he called things, ridiculous things that no one really needs. The water turned brown and smoke filled the sky. My animal friends had to all say goodbye. But then someone like you, who carry a lot, came to the forest to this very spot. They planted new seeds down deep in the ground since seedlings began to grow all around. The forest grew back with truffula trees, once more their soft tufts would blow in the breeze. My friends will return, and here they will stay, so long as the trees do not go away. Now it's the job of each girl and boy to keep our trees safe for all to enjoy. Okay, so now I'm going to read this book that's also written by Dr. Seuss. There's a walk it in my pocket did you have did you ever have the feeling there's a basket in your basket or a newly in your burly or a rosset in your closet sometimes i feel quite certain there's a dritten in in the curtain. Sometimes I have the feeling there's a rock behind the clock. And that thief, the zelf up on the shelf, I have talked to him myself. That's the kind of house I live in. There's a nink in the sink and the zam in the lamp. And they're rather nice, I think. Some of them are very friendly. I like the yacht in the pot. But that yacht in the bottle, some friendly, some are not. I like the table on the table. But the sofa on the sofa, well, I wish he wasn't there. All those nut boards in the cupboards, they're good fun to have about. But toothbrush on my toothbrush, him, I could do without. The only one I'm really scared of is that bug under the rug. And the creamy chimney up the chimney I don't like him not at all and it makes me sort of nervous when the zail scoots down the hall but the yeeps the yeps on the steps they're great fun to have around and so are many many other friends that I have found like the teller and the nella and the gala and the 
Della and the Bella and the Wella and the Zella and the in the cellar. In the gilling on the ceiling. In the zower in my shower. In the zillow on my pillow. I don't care if you believe it. That's the kind of house I live in and I hope we never leave it. Okay, thank, thanks for listening to me reading. Now, now remember to keep to keep reading. Bye.